Hello and welcome to a quick and to the point tutorial. Today we're going to load an image onto a plane. Sometimes we need to do things manually. So anyhow, let's get rid of the cube. We're going to start by adding a mesh as a plane. The image we're going to do is standard video, 1080p. So we're going to do the width is HD is 1920. So scale X 1920. Then scale the Y of 1080. Now scale the whole thing, 0 0.001, to a manageable size. Rotate on the x-axis, 90, and then move it up on the z-axis. Turn on rendering mode in the EV engine. Let's go to the world and turn the lights down. This background here is where the, the uh, universal lighting comes from. We don't want it too bright. Now, select it. Now let's go to the uh, materials. We're going to create a new material. C call it image doesn't really matter what we call it and select it. so now let's go to uh, shading turn on the rendering mode again do this we're going to set this one aside unhook it we're going to be creating an emit emitter so we're going to add a shader as an emission shader emission output to the surface you can check it's working okay it's fine, doesn't really matter what color. Now we're going to go up and we're going to add a texture, an image texture, right there. Take the color output into the color right there. Now we're going to open one from the disk. Select it, and it comes in. Now what we need to do is turn on auto refresh so when you change your frames in your Blender animation, this image will update frame by frame so you can see the right thing for the right frame. Now, <clears throat> there's a cyclic option that makes it cycle through it over and over again. That would be a, a different tutorial. But for now, I'm just going to put 1,000 frames, which is more than enough to get through the entire animation without cutting off. And let's go back out now to the layout window. Now, if all goes well, as we right-click and pull through, we're going to see... we're going to see the image. Now we can do the same thing with just a still image or video. It doesn't matter. Blender is pretty good about that. So now, that's pretty much how you do it. Not much more than that. Pretty simple. So see you next time in another quick and to the point tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe. Thanks for watching.